Okay, so what resources do you have for revision? Well, the first thing I would say is begin by going through these questions in the booklet here. So these are some basic questions that were poorly done on past cats. Uh, so I think that this would be really great for you to work through first, just to make sure that you're you're good on kind of um, some things that people didn't do well in the cat. Now, there are lots of other things you need to master. Uh, don't just rely on these questions here. This is just a few questions, uh, but I really think the best place to start is with this booklet here. Then once you've done that, you then want to start working your way uh, through all the practice papers here. So that's what it says here, work through practice exams provided, uh, refer to videos for help on these questions. The videos will help you revise at a faster pace as they will hopefully clarify any, uncer any uncertainty immediately. So if we go through here, you'll see at the top of every page, there are videos. There are videos for every single exam here. That's correct. There's a video for every exam. These are all the questions there. So. Um, that's really, really handy, I feel. Just so you know, with your exam twos, the last couple of questions, or the last three or four questions of the multiple choice are really gonna be tricky. And that's by design, that is how your year 12 exams are created. And I've actually stolen some year 12 questions here uh, to put towards the end. And you know, you gotta get used to seeing some tricky questions there. But remember, you've got videos uh, for when you do get stuck. And then also remember for your exam one, the last question, and you know other questions as well, but particularly the last question is really going to be quite tricky. So don't get thrown by that. Be prepared for the fact that the last question is going to be tricky. That's how these are designed. We're preparing you for year 12. Uh, all right, next, thoroughly to review past CAT with CAT solutions. Uh, so thoroughly review past CAT solutions. All past CAT solutions can be found on the OneNote. Ensure you understand all questions in past CATs. So here, I've put them all here just for your convenience here. So here are all your past cats. And if you just click on these links, it will just take you to the relevant section here. And they're all here. So if we come back here, we could say, all right, what about circular functions? And it will take us here. Um, now, cat four solutions for probability. Well, there's nothing here yet. Uh, but once you've all sat cat four, I'll put the solutions to that there. Can you imagine if I put it there now? My goodness, you'd all cheat. Um, but yes, that's how it's designed there. Let's come back here for a moment. What else do we have? It says create your bound reference. That's another really great way to revise. Work through this booklet thoroughly. That's what I said before. Make sure you work through this booklet uh, and then review past exercises and practice cats. So that's really useful as well. Okay, and I've also put in here your cat notification. So make sure you read through this thoroughly and you understand what's required of you. And if you ever have any questions, uh, feel free to shoot me a message. All right, I'll see you in the next part.